Hey everyone, got my final video here for these Smash Wrestling uh, events coming up here this week. We have uh, Smash Wrestling's biggest show of the year, their WrestleMania, their Starcade, it's Super Showdown. This is my first exposure to Smash Wrestling uh, proper. This is going to be the first true Smash Wrestling show I'll see. Uh, I'll be going to the Smash Wrestling vs. Progress Wrestling show on Wednesday, but that's that's kind of, you know, I'll see some of the guys, but uh, this is going to be a more, this is going to be Smash Wrestling show proper, and it's going to be uh, probably way different than the Progress vs. show. I don't really know much what to expect, so I'm kind of kind of run down the card quickly a little bit because I, I can't really go much into detail about what the matches are about or anything, so the stories. So I'll kind of break it down quick. The main event is Kevin Bennett defending his Smash Wrestling Championship against Speedball Mike Bailey. Uh, I've mentioned before, I've never seen Kevin Bennett before. I don't really know who he is or anything, what he's about. Um, but I have seen Speedball Mike Bailey wrestle on Demand Progress on some of their shows in England. Um, so I know what, what he's about. Uh, but that'll be cool to see the, how that turns out and, and who wins. You know, I don't really have a stake either way in who wins the championship. Uh, so it'll be fun to see the, the back and forth and, and who comes out the victor. So there are a couple of Smash Wrestling specific matches that I don't know anything about I've never seen like I say I've said I've never seen the Smash Wrestling show and never followed the stories but there are a couple of matches that I'll talk about just naming them off so one of the matches is Psycho Mike against the Blade and that's a grudge match it's being billed as and I don't know what that means but uh, we'll see how it plays out the other match is Halal Beefcake defending their tag team championships. I don't know who those guys are. I don't know who they're wrestling. The event doesn't say. So, you know, I'm not going to come at it cynically. I'm going to be like, well, I'm excited to see these guys. I'm excited to see who they are and, you know, see their brand of wrestling. The match that I recognized immediately that I thought would be really cool to see is Walter and Daisuke Sekimoto against Brent Banks and Tariq uh, in a tag team match. Um, like I said, I've seen both Walter and uh, Daisuke before, and uh, we'll see how this goes, and this should be fun. So the other match here, the next match is Rosemary against Sebastian Suave. Uh, I think it's the same Rosemary from Impact Wrestling, I believe, uh, and in the story in Smash Wrestling, she was, she was exiled by Sebastian Swab and now she's back. Um, so I can expect that to be very heated, very emotional. Uh, I can expect Rosemary to come out of House of Fire at the beginning and just be very uh, uh, headstrong uh, early on. Another women's match, uh, Lufisto, who is who I've seen wrestle in Evolve. I think I saw her wrestle in New Orleans uh, and I know, I know I did see her wrestle in New Orleans. Um, she was okay. Uh, I mean, I, it was my first exposure to her, so I was kind of meh about it. But uh, she takes on Jordan Grace, and uh, hopefully they'll have a good match. I'm sure they will. They're both talented. Uh, not to take anything away from Lufisto that she isn't talented. She's been doing this. I know that she's been doing pro, she's been a pro wrestler for 20 years, so she knows what she's doing. I just, I guess at that time it evolved, I saw her in New Orleans, it was just, you know, I didn't really know the context of the match, so maybe that took away from my experience of her, but I hope this won't be the same way, because I, I don't know, I, I know that Mephisto was taken on Jordan Grace, but I don't know if there's a backstory or anything, but just based purely on a match, uh, I think it should be good at the very least. So, the Smash Wrestling Company, they say there's more to be expected uh, from this show that's, that hasn't been announced yet. Um, so I'm gonna say that this should be fun. This should be a fun experience. I'm always excited to see new wrestling, see different kinds of, of wrestling. So uh, like I said, I don't really know what to expect 
from the event itself, but that's kind of part of the fun. That is part of the fun. That That is a lot of the fun for me is going to see different kinds of wrestling. Uh, that's what intrigued me a lot about this weekend in Toronto was they've got wrestling from England. They've got wrestling from Canada, obviously. They've got wrestling from Germany. And they also have wrestling from uh, China, the Oriental Wrestling Entertainment Company is debuting in Canada. I'm not seeing them, um, but they've got all different kinds of international flavors of pro wrestling um, in town. So that will be cool uh, for fans. So at the time I'm recording this, it's the night before I leave to go drive to Toronto. And uh, that'll be a fun drive. I'm, I'm excited for that. Uh, it'll be a long drive, about four and a half hours, but that's okay. Uh, once I get to the to Canada, across the border, that that will be fun. It'll be a whole new experience for me personally. Super Showdown for Smash Wrestling uh, is Friday at 8 p.m. at the Midtown Event Theater in downtown Toronto, Ontario, Canada. Uh, it'll be my last show uh, of the five that I'm seeing. I'll make a playlist of all my videos, of all the, the uh, five videos I've made and kind of put them together so that if anybody's interested, they can check them out in a list. Um, and are you gonna be there? Let me know, let me know in the comments if you're gonna be there, I'll, you know, upload the videos, um, like and subscribe. And I will see you there.